Hi, welcome to Shruti Lakshmi's virtual classroom. Today we're going to see a easy and fast way to count number of triangles. Part three. I have made two other videos to count number of triangles. Here's the suggested link over here. Let's see the first figure. In this first figure, there are two diagonals. One diagonal and two diagonal. And there are four parts. One, two, three and four. So we multiply two into four. Two into four is eight. So there are eight triangles in this square. Let's see how. One, two, three, and four. Fifth, sixth, seventh, and eighth. This is how we got eight triangles in this square. Let's see for this rectangle. Okay, there are two diagonals. One and two. And... There are 8 parts. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. So we multiply 2 into 8 which gives us 16. So there are 16 triangles in this big rectangle. Let's see how. There is already 8 parts. And next this is the 9th, 10th, 11th and 12th. And next 13th, 14th and next 15th and 16th. This is how we get 16 triangles in this big rectangle. Instead of counting each triangle individually, we can use this easy and fast method to count the number of triangles. Let's see another figure. In this figure, there are two squares. In the last example, there was one square. It had two diagonals and four parts. Same over here, except there are two of them. See this uh, uh, square. It's the same as this one. It's two times four equal to eight. So this square only, this square only has 8 triangles. And this square only also has 8 triangles. So we add 8 plus 8 which gives us 16. But we are not over yet. We, ha we still have 2 more triangles. Because these 2 are combined. So 1 triangle and 2. Two triangles. So we add 16 plus 2. 16 plus 2 is 18. So there are 18 triangles in this rectangle. Let's try another figure. In this figure, there are three squares. 1, 2 and 3. In the last example, there were two squares and it was, it was 18. This time, remember that each square has eight triangles. So, eight, eight and eight triangles for each of these squares. Next, we add them together. So, eight plus eight plus eight. 8 plus 8 plus 8 is 24. And in this one, we saw that since they are combined together, we get two more triangles. Okay, since three squares are combined together, let's see, there will be four squares. Because look, one, let's just look at these two squares. One triangle, two triangle. Next, let's just look at these two squares. We already have two triangles, three triangle and four triangle. So we add 24 plus 4. 24 plus 4 is 28. 
So, there are 28 triangles in this big rectangle. Thanks for watching.